Hello everyone. Today, we will be talking about the new study which says humans can be blamed for droughts, and they're about to get worse. Human activity has probably had an impact on the world's risk of drought since the start of the 20th century. According to a new study, droughts related to climate change will get much worse. It can cost the US up to $10 billion, and it's the second most costly weather disaster. It can drive up food costs, threaten drinking water, and increase the risk of wildfires and cause mass migrations. In 2005, parts of the Amazon basin experienced the worst drought in 100 years. A 23 July 2006 article reported Woods Hole Research Center results showing that the forest in its present form could survive only three years of drought. Scientists at the Brazilian National Institute of Amazonian Research argue in the article that this drought response, coupled with the effects of deforestation on regional climate, are pushing the rainforest towards a tipping point, where it would irreversibly start to die. Greenhouse gases generated by power plants, farming, human activities, and trains have caused the drought risk. This has increased quite a bit in the last 50 years. And it has been accelerating since 1900. These have been caused by human activities, with the drying trend being a related issue to the increase of greenhouse gas emissions. Even when droughts were fewer, there was also increased the production of aerosols, and this can affect cloud cover and the rainfall, and there is more research being done. The researchers do link the new study to more research that directly links the increase in a drought that happens towards the end of the 20th century, with the increase of greenhouse gases. There is a possibility of a link, but more evidence is needed. In addition to the global changes in regional temperature, along with rainfall, these droughts have been impacted by these human activities. It could become worse over time. It is hard to gauge how much human activity has affected droughts. Because one region will get droughts, and the other won't be hit with one at the same time but might get it in another year. Complicating what the records show, and while these records are not as detailed as scientists like, they can still use this to draw conclusions. There is a new study figured out though that has an interesting type of workaround, where they use modern models to combine with the records from trees. Trees are a good way to monitor the weather because the concentric circles within the inside of a tree can tell the age. And it can even tell scientists the type of weather during that year. If the line tends to be wider, then the year was warm. But if it is colder, then they tend to be thinner, and that's because the rings do not grow as much. So those rings would be skinnier. Climate change and the modern greenhouse gas emissions can be seen in trees as well. And unfortunately, this also says that there might be more droughts to come with time. This is a result of human consequences, especially in North America and Eurasia. And it is likely to be more and more severe over time. Droughts are no joke, and they can get quite pricey. So it is definitely something that we should keep a bit of an eye on, especially if you're worried about the future. Remember, without a radical change in both climate policy and water management, things will only get worse. I hope you will find it informative. Please share your comments below and do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.